Welcome back, and as promised, the Joy of Jazz Festival is taking place this weekend. In studio, we have members of the Standard Bank National Youth Jazz Band who will be performing at the event tonight. We're going to introduce them quickly. We've got Amanda with us here today. We've also got Moses, and we've got Desiree. Desiree is not a member of the orchestra. She is actually one of the people behind bringing us this festival. And perhaps let's begin with you then, Des. How big is Joy of Jazz this year? Well, thank you for having us. Um, it's a real privilege to be able to um, be here with members of the, of the band. Um, it, it, the Standard Bank Joy of Jazz is one of the biggest jazz festivals on the continent. Um, and we have like 25 um, acts on stage over the three day period. And tonight is the final night of the event. But what is absolutely special about this occasion is the fact that um, we were able um, to present an opportunity to the National Youth Jazz Band to perform at this very special occasion and I'm sure Moses and Amanda will be sharing a little bit more detail with you on that but what is so special for us is that it is a culmination of um, many months of work um, that started way back in the National Arts Festival um, where Amanda got to select uh, members of her band um, and that's how we find ourselves here a really incredible group of young people that are essentially the future of jazz talent in South Africa and let's speak to the youngest person in the room at the moment, Moses. Uh, young people are taking up DJing, a lot are going into genres like gom, kwaito, gospel, why jazz? I don't know, jazz chose me. Mm -hmm. Something I was exposed to at a very young age. And I, I think, yeah, I'm gonna emphasize the fact that it chose me. I didn't choose jazz. And I was told that um, you speak about how jazz chose you and when you began, before getting into the orchestra, you couldn't even read music, but now you're right at home doing all of that. Yeah, uh, it was hard at first because I didn't have theoretical training. Mm -hmm. I used to do more practicals than theory at the foundation where I was studying, the Moses Malelic Arts Foundation. But as time went by, I asked for help from senior members who were in the foundation before, which are now in varsity. And they helped me with some theory there and there, but now I'm in varsity and things are getting on a lighter page. Amanda, you are the woman in charge of the orchestra. Uh, how do you go about keeping the music fresh and relevant to an ever-evolving audience, especially at events such as Standard Bank Joy of Jazz? I think the key thing is to showcase not only the playing talent of the, of the young musicians, but also their composition talent, because all of the members of the, the band are great composers and writers and they're writing music that's fresh that's young so we're bringing that music to a fresh and young audience mm. from these wonderful young players and Ezra was telling us just how from an organizational point of view they begin planning quite early on in the year from as early as the time of the Grahamstown Fest as a conductor when do you begin to get your troops ready for a performance as big as this one so the process um, is mostly for me begins a little bit before the Grahamstown, Standard Bank Grahamstown Festival, um, deciding on some music and possibilities. And then at the Standard Bank National Youth Jazz Festival, there's a rigorous audition process to select the players. And I'm part of the last part, uh, kind of the last um, round of auditions. And then we start to work with the young band that's selected and it's a very intense four days, all day, sometimes well into the evening, rehearsing, workshopping, collaborating with these young musicians to bring their music to the stage. And Desiree, we're speaking today about an orchestra. It sounds very much like a purist dream, but like with any other festival, we've seen the Standard Bank Joy of Jazz begin to evolve. How are you bridging that gap between the purists and people who indeed enjoy music but would like something a little more contemporary in between? Well, the, the advantage that we have is that we don't have to struggle um, to get the attention of South Africans on jazz. I mean, a recent um, research that I've been exposed to indicated that there are 17 million people in this country who like jazz. Now that is an achievement in its own. It's almost, um, almost half the population um, of, well, it's one, uh, two, uh, one third of the population of the country. But I think the important thing is to keep it authentic that um, audiences can relate. And, um, and in our efforts to keep the music alive, we ensure that the 
the development or talent pipeline um, keeps it fresh um, and they bring in their own unique talent into, into the space. So um, what is really amazing is that you see Moses here today um, with the, the National um, Youth Jazz Band. And this is the very same stage that the likes of Tandin Duli and uh, Bokani Dreyer, who are pe both performing at the, at the Stand Up and Joy of Jazz, have come from. That's how they grew in their, in their careers through the programs that Standard Bank invests in. Speaking of growing and launching talent, do you have a spot for me on the stage? I mean, <laughs> maybe a 30 minute set? <laughs> Perhaps you could start by auditioning for Amanda. But this is my audition. <laughs> well, the, the musical ear belongs with Amanda. Amanda? Well, we'll have to book do you think first. I've got the potential? We'll have to hear you first. What I can't do with vocals, I'm sure I can do with an outfit. Anyway, <laughs> Moses, uh, let's come back to you. Um, is this your first Joy of Jazz? Yes, this is my first. And what is the one piece you're looking forward to performing? The one piece I'm looking forward to performing. Wow. I don't know, the music, everybody's music. I mean, everybody has different compositions and each song has a certain feeling that it gives you and I'm looking forward to having all these different... Okay, Desiree Boy from the organizing committee of the Standard Bank Joy of Jazz. Moses, Amanda, thank you all so much for your time, but you guys aren't going away as yet. We're going to disappear for a short while and then when we come back, we have a bit of a musical treat for you. This is ENCA Now.